Hello guys, what up? This is that 12 Alex and today's tutorial is how to make a really smooth slow motion with Vegas Pro. Now before I even start with the tutorial, I just want to let you guys know that today's video is sponsored by Envanto Market. From there on the video hive or audio jungle, you can get really nice stock footage like time lapse as well project file for After Effects or Premiere Pro and you can get also a high quality SFX and music. So make sure to check it out now in the link down below. So when talking about slow motion with Vegas Pro, I go ahead and check it out on YouTube and I see most tutorials out there just teaching you guys how to slow down a 30 frame per second clip with a plugin called Twixter. And I just don't understand what's the point of shooting at 30 frames per second and try to slow down in post using plugins. It just doesn't make sense to me. So the basic fundamental to make a really smooth slow motion is to shoot in highest frame rate available. So I believe most camera nowadays can shoot up to 60 frames per second, even up to 120 like my camera, for example, which is the Sony A6500. You can shoot 120 in full HD. Even decent smartphones nowadays can shoot 4K 60 frames. So I believe most of us nowadays have the options or accessibility to shoot a high frame rate video. So use it if you decided to slow down your video. If you accidentally shoot in 30 frames per second and you have no any backup clips, then it makes sense to try to use plugins to slow, to slow down the 30 frame per second clip. So here in Vegas Pro, I have three different clips that have been shot in three different frame rates. Now each frame rates will be somehow related to the timeline frame rates. And the first clip here was shot in 30 frame per second. The second uh, clip here was shot in 60 frame per second. And the third one here was shot in 120. Each of these frame rates have its limit when it comes to slow motion. Now here I'm working on 24 frames timeline. Now if I'm doing for uh, client projects or for video assignments, I will change my timeline into 25 frames per second, which is PAL format, which is basically um, the standard of broadcast frame rate here in my country. Now for America, Japan, some few certain country use NTSC format, which is 30 frames per second. Now I'm not gonna go in detail about that. If you're just making a content for YouTube, 24, 25, and 30 is the number that you would like to render out. So it's all depends on your own personal preference. So there will be some math involved, but don't worry, it is a super simple math. All you have to do here is to divide your video frame rate with the project timeline frame rates and then you will get the answer uh, which is 100% speed then divided with the answer you got previously and then you will get the next answer which is the percentage of the limit the video can go to slow motion. So to make things even understandable I'm just gonna open up calculator real quick. Like I said each of frame rates have its limit. So the first clip here was shot in 30 frames. So 30 divided by 25 frames equal to 1.2. So then 100% speed divide with uh, 1.2, you will got 83%. So with a number of 83, that's the limit for this video can go to slow down. So how you slow down in Vegas Pro, there's a two way. One is by go to the very end of the clip and then press control and then you will see a time stretch and you can stretch it up. But I'm not going to use that uh, method. I always use velocity. So just right click, insert velocity. Now from here, go to the very first keyframe of the velocity. You're going to right click and set it to 83%. And there you go, some subtle amount of slow motion because like I said, 30 frame per second clip, you can barely slow it down. Now for a second clip here, this is a video that was shot in 60 frame per second. So it's a really same method. So it's 60 frames divided by 25 frame per second of the timeline. 
and I got 2.4 so then 100% speed divide 2.4 you'll got 41% so this clip here can only go up to 41% of slow motions so right click insert velocity go to the very first keyframe set to 41% and there you go really smooth buttery slow motion there's no any choppy uh, kind of looking here and the final clip clip here was shot in 120 frame per seconds so it's the same thing 120 divide 25 equal 4.8 and 100% divide uh, 4.8 you will got 20% of slow-mo so you are just gonna insert a velocity go to the very first keyframe set to 20% for velocity there you go so that's how you do a very smooth slow motion in Vegas Pro and you can apply the same concept and formula in any editing software like Final Cut, Premiere Pro, Avid and so on. So hope you guys like this tutorial and if you have any question related you can just leave it down in the comment section. So see you guys next time.